Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Advanced English for Free. Today, we have a special session on Advanced English Grammar with our student, Emma, and I, Riaz, an instructor. Emma, how are you feeling about today's lesson? I'm excited but a bit nervous. I know I've got some grammar challenges. That's okay, Emma. We're here to help you and our viewers understand advanced grammar concepts. Let's start with prepositions. Emma, please share a sentence with a preposition. I'm good on playing the piano. Good try, Emma, but it should be I'm good at playing the piano. The correct preposition here is at. Next, we have dangling participles. Emma, your sentence, please. Running down the street, the car hit a pothole. Almost there, Emma. It should be while I was running down the street, the car hit a pothole. We need to clarify who was running. Now, let's look at complex sentences. Emma, your example. Although I'm tired, but I'll go to the party. You're on the right track, Emma. It should be although I'm tired, I'll go to the party. You don't need but after although in this case. Moving on to verb tenses. Emma, please provide a sentence. I will have visited London next year. Close, Emma. It should be I will visit London next year. The use of will have visited isn't necessary here. Let's talk about subject verb agreement. Emma, your turn. The team were playing exceptionally well. You're getting there, Emma. It should be the team was playing exceptionally well. Team is a singular subject, so we use was. That concludes our lesson on advanced English grammar mistakes. Emma, thank you for your courage in learning with us today. It was my pleasure, and remember, everyone, learning grammar is a process. Mistakes help us improve. If you found this helpful, please like, subscribe, and share. Keep practicing, and your English grammar skills will grow. Until next time, stay tuned for more advanced English for free. Goodbye.